guys what is up i am finally back again with another video now obviously i'd like to start it off by just saying look i'm sorry i didn't post in a little while and uh as you can see i'm going to be playing some rainbow six siege so yeah we will be pretty good i'm playing on barlet university with my uh squad they're just giving me these amazing call outs so i can just pick them off one by one so that i don't know if you can tell by the way they're playing but they're obviously not playing um as a team they're all playing individually not communicating and when they don't when they do that that's when someone like me and my squad can give the call outs and we can just pick them off one by one but yeah it went pretty well and i don't think this glass understood the fact that i was able to flank and therefore it made that rubbish maneuver anyway that's on other side you know i'm trying to play objective but i'm not playing in objective and I'm not roaming, I'm just playing around the area, which I think is really key in this game, just to play around objective and never play in it. Because you play in it, they know exactly where you are, they just come in and they just wreck you. But if uh, you don't play in it, then you can like see what I'm doing, I'm rotating every so often, and I keep just checking your window, and then I get the call out from my friend, he says, oh yeah, by the way, he's where you got glass. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. And I just try and, I'm trying to push through, but uh, obviously, if you if you walk like I just did, then it makes footsteps. So I had to crouch, and um, it's going pretty well. And as I see him, I see the other guy as well. So I try and get a clap, which didn't work. And then I try and I'm, and I'm thinking, oh yeah, four kills. I'm gonna get the ace, and I'm I'm certain I shot him. I am so certain I shot him in the face then. But apparently I didn't. And this guy just goes in and steals my ace. I mean, how do you do that? This, that? this guy's in my squad, and he just goes in and steals my ace why but yeah we have this uh this round which i don't really want to talk about didn't go too well for me yeah it didn't go that well i'll do the preparation phase and then i'll kind of like skip further to the end because i don't think you really guys guys really want to watch this it's a bit embarrassing but anyway i was just thinking that you know i never ever want to play ranked on my own because it's literally the worst idea on this game because the whole point of this game is that you communicate with other people in your team they tell you when a good time to push on the other team is or when a good time to do anything and then you just do it but when you're on your own you're like you you, you have to watch cams and then it leaves you vulnerable and then you don't really know what's going on so that's why that's why I only been playing a squad. But anyway, this is uh, not the best of rounds. So I'll just skip here. Yeah. And, uh, well, as you can see, I got a kill, but I died. And, well, it was not very good. And it's a 2v1, yeah? And you think, oh, 2v1, we've got this, we've got this. And this guy's like, okay, he gets killed. As you look at this, he's like trying to get him, and he gets killed. And he goes in, I'm like, yeah, he's right there, hard right. And he's like, okay, okay. And he just doesn't even bother shooting him. And then that just happens. I mean, what is going on? I mean, just, just really? <sighs> it was really disappointing. Not in time. But in. yeah. <sighs> <coughs> it was not good. Anyway. We then defend, I think, Model Hall. And I thought, well... Since I'm kind of playing okay with Bandit, I got four kills in the first round. I thought, yeah, why not? Let's just go Bandit again. And, well, you'll see. Anyway, if you are enjoying this video so far, make sure you go down, smash that like, leave a comment, uh, and make sure you subscribe for more content. And when you do subscribe, press the little bell so every time I do post a video, you know about it and you can watch it and, you know, hopefully you can learn from it. I mean, I learn from watching my own videos when I just completely fail miserably. I told you just like completely walk past someone and I'll just not see it and then I'll watch it back and I'll just be like, oh wow, why'd you do that? But, that's what these are for, I guess. It's just so I can show you how I have fun with my mates playing this game. And then, obviously, I learn from my mistakes. And you can learn from my mistakes as well. But um, I thought maybe Model Hall would be the hard to defend as, as a four man. But then you know, you know, my, my squad is like, yeah, yeah, we can do, it, we can do, it, we got this. So you know, 
I just thought I'd have a bit of fun here with the act with the model wall. And I was trying to see if I could, because you know I've seen people do it, and I've seen people like destroy it, but I've never seen anyone destroy it without using a bullet. So I thought, oh okay, I'll just I'll just walk, crawl all over it and everything, and nothing was happening. It was quite funny. But uh, yeah, this is a pr I think it's a pretty decent round. It's a uh, it's got a couple weird stuff. I mean, look at this. Watch this. Like the glass messes. I'm like, oh okay. I start shooting at him, and somehow he just doesn't die. It doesn't even die. And then my friend just runs straight past him and doesn't even kill him. It's, I mean, like, what? What's going on? It's just crazy. And uh, my teammate decides he'll open a hatch, which turns out for the worse, as you will see in a second. He kind of gets destroyed by fuse. And it's just not good. He doesn't get destroyed by a cluster charge. He just gets destroyed by just using his AK gun. So, yeah. But, never mind. Doesn't really matter. So, yeah, he just, look at that, he just gets one tapped. And, uh, he's like, oh, yeah, quick, quick, come help me, come help me. He's on the stairs, on the stairs. I'm like, yeah, yeah, okay, I'll drop down the hatch. He's like, no, he shot me from the hatch. I'm just, I'm just kind of, and then I get here and I'm thinking, uh, I'm actually kind of stuck. I'm thinking, oh my god, what have I done? Because there's a fuse down there somewhere. And no one knows if he's rotated or not. And then I see this one guy. In a second, I see this look. He's like, I see this rook. He's like peeking. I'm thinking, oh, okay. Yeah, I'll get this guy. I'll get this guy for you. So I break it down. And it's just peeking no one. I'm just like, what are you doing, mate? You're just peeking no one. So obviously, then I hit Ash. I think I hit an Ash. I'm not quite sure. So I was like running around. And I go, oh, yeah, she's going to be out here. So my friend told me she's out there. And I was thinking, oh, okay, that's cool. And obviously... I mean, I swear, I mean, I swear, I shot across her face. I shot across her, her cap that says FBI. I mean, I was certain I shot her in the head. I mean, you can watch that back over and over again. But I am certain that was a headshot. But yeah, so it was a 3v2, which isn't great. And I, I told them that the Ash was gonna was pushing in the objective. And it was good because dumb I didn't see him, so that was good. But I told him I was pushing objective, I was saying, so I have to scan him on the camera. So I show him he's on the camera, you could just see his feet going objective, and he goes, okay, 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 cool. And I mean, like, oh, wow. Then he gets him, and then look how unlucky this is. Oh, reloading, and Fuse just gets him. And then Fuse goes to reload after he tries to shoot my, not mine, but the ADS. Anyway, we have another preparation phase, which I thought was pretty boring, so you probably don't want to watch it. And then we have this round, it's 2-1. And it's a three man because one of the one of my players in my squad just went, Oh by the way, I've got to go. So, oh great, thanks. Thanks a lot. Anyway, he left. It's a middle of a ranked match. He left. And um well I've got my friend just checking, I said, Is that is that all clear? He went, yeah, it's all clear. I was like, okay, cool, just 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 gonna do the old uh, jumping in. And uh, well, when I get in, you're not even gonna believe this. Watch this. So I'm like I, I decide I'll peek around here and I'm thinking and I see that red, and I'm like, oh, laser sight. And I just go to shoot it, and I realise it was a book. I was like, wow. How bad was that? Then I hide behind this little bookshelf. I'm thinking, oh, a drone. And you hear those footsteps. And I was like, oh, footsteps, okay. And now, watch this. Watch this. You know where it goes, the crosshairs go red when you hit someone? Yeah, it went red. So as soon as I hit him, he just didn't die. And then look at that. How is he not dead? <laughs> it's just what was happening. My bullets just weren't registering this day. But obviously, I was going to let that get the better of me. And then that guy just flanked around, like, like proper flanked around without anyone seeing him. And uh, it's all right, though, because it's now a 3v2. And I decided I'll just smash this without anyone knowing. And my teammates just freak out because they thought they were coming. But, um, yeah, I was going pretty well at this stage, actually. And then... Uh, Blinking EDS. It was really annoying. Anyway, then I'm pushing in. I'm thinking, oh yeah, we got this. We could push in hard, push in hard and fast, and then we'll uh, catch him out because there's only two of them. And then there's Ash gives our position away completely. I'm like, wow. Because, you know, at this moment, I threw that frag in to get their attention over there. And, um, well, as you can see, he's still peeking there. But I thought, okay, right. I thought Ash gave our position away, and it was really annoying. And then he gets that dock, and I, I'm still always on the work. He didn't say anything. I was just not even thinking. I run in. I'm like, yeah, oh, he's dead. <clears throat> and it's just 
and it was just not funny. It was just annoying. And then I think it was a cap can that was lost. And I was thinking, where is this cap can? And then you know, one guy, the ash, decides, oh yeah, great idea, I'll just vault down and get destroyed. So I'm thinking, okay, where is this cap can? Where is this cap can? And then I'm thinking, he's not an objective. But then no, he's there. So I think that, well, if he's there, I'll just spray him with bullets. And my friend decided to leave objective and just try and go get him. So I was the only one in the objective, and that went. And it was so good. I mean, it was so good. Anyway, I'm just going to um, get straight back onto the defending round. I'll go bandit again. And yeah, very good. I'll just skip the preparation phase. And well, we decided that even though there's only three of us, it'd be a great idea to defend lounge. Which I thought was the worst idea, actually. <laughs> but anyway... I just thought I'd just get those quick, cheeky uh, spawn peeks in. And look at this, you're not even ready for this. This is like, another case of my bullets not registering. I'm like, where is he, where is he? Oh, there he is. I just one tap him in the head. And then look, there's a Nash there. I just, what, look at that, I'm one tapping her in the head. And nothing happened all three times. I mean, how? How has that not happened? Obviously, I'm trying to make it so the window doesn't break when I smash it. And then that just happens, I'm like, oh, for God's sake. But, then I know the ash is still out there. And I'm thinking, don't jump out because she knows you're there now. And um, I really had no idea what to do. I'm thinking, this ash either, either this ash is lagging out, and that's why the bullets aren't registering, or my I'm lagging out, and when I jump out, I won't be able to get her. So it's a bad idea. But then I get the kill assist. I'm like, okay, so I did hit her. And somehow, a headshot isn't a kill anymore. I know. It's just dumb. Unless you're using illusion, so Cav's pistol. It's just dumb. But anyway, my friend's telling me there's a fuse upstairs. So I'm thinking, oh god, this is not going to be good. And, well, I think in a minute he's going to get him. But I was, I was mainly focused on trying to pick off this last person. Last I believe it's a sledge. And then, my friend decided that, said, oh yeah, I'll, uh, I'll come and bait for you. you and I said, come bait out here, main entrance. He was like, yeah, sure, one second, let me just peek this window. And he decides that he's going to come bait. It just comes, and this is the f this is so funny right now. You're gonna be I'm gonna I'm really embarrassed about this moment, but it happened, and anyway, look at this. I'm like, oh yeah, come bait, come bait, and I just turn around, goes out there, and just gets destroyed. I'm like, oh my god, where is he? Where is he? So I see him running through objective, and uh, yeah, no, I know, I know, potato aim, and then watch this is even worse potato aim. I mean, what is that? What is that? It was so bad. And then I decided that I'd make the most of the two seconds you have. Two, one, bang. And I got him. It's a good game. It's a really, really good, funny game. But it was a 3v4, and we still won, I think, 4 1. So, you know. Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy that video, make sure you give it a massive thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell, and. You ready for my next video? I'll see you next time, guys.